Uh, Trent, you had some pretty good stretches of good ball. Probably just didn't make it rain, I guess, when, when you had those opportunities. So. Yeah, I think probably summed us up all year, the unforced errors and set ends at crucial times again. And um, they're courageous and they try hard, but I said before, that's not enough to win you the game in the NRL. You, you've got to control the footy. And until we fix our set ends at crucial times there again, our first set in the second half, dropping the ball off a drop out, little things like that you just can't do. So. Disappointed, Trent. You had an opportunity to win that game, but you know, in the balance of half time, and, and yet yeah. you were out, out played and out enthused. They got over the line three times. Yeah. How disappointing is that when, when you had that chance? And... Yeah, it's, it is disappointing, mate. And, but as I said before, and, until we learn to, we cut out those those individual errors that that we're making and build pressure and come up with the right kick at the right time. Well, we're gonna. Be, I sound like. A broken record with the press conference is the same every week, and um, it's not 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 good enough. You've been disappointed in some of your big, uh, some of your recruits, Tran. I mean, I, I don't think anyone expected you to win the comp this year, but I think it's fair to say you were expected to do a lot better than you have. Like guys like Dufty, um, Hang On Junior was pretty quiet tonight. Um, yeah. What, 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 what do you make of those guys? They need to step up. I think everyone does, mate. I, look, I'm not going to single out. An individual, I thought across the board we we um, um, just making too many errors, mate, and making it too hard on ourselves. And I think everyone needs to have a look at themselves. Yeah. What was you thinking with Tavita's rotation there, Trent? I think you saved him to the last ten minutes. Was that what did you have in mind there? Um, yeah, we were looking. We look, he was looking a little bit tired at times, so. <laughs> I thought Patolo done a fair job when he went on. A little error there defensively, but he's a young player with some ability. But um, yeah, it's just how it panned out. Josh, you look pretty frustrated. Can you tell us your emotions at the moment? Oh, it's just the same thing, mate. You know, it's no point overcomplicating it. It's just our inability to hold onto the footy. Um, and it's unforced errors that are killing us at the moment, particularly at crucial times, after points, um, to set start of the second half, um, kick one out on the full. Um, just given uh, opposition teams too much possession um, in our own half and at, at times we defend really well but at the moment we're just doing too much of it. So if you've been through some tough years in recent years, I would imagine you thought this year maybe there'd be some progress given the players you're brought in. In terms of results at least there hasn't been a lot of progress. Right? What's that like for you when you probably start the season? Like yeah, you know, yeah, it's, it's frustrating but um, We've certainly got the ability to, to be winning games and to be competing a lot better than what we are, and that's the frustration in it. I think we're a lot better team than um, how we perform every week, and it's not it's not game plan, it's not preparation. It comes down to the night and maybe concentration, but individuals just making sure they hang on to the footy. Trent, when you talk about set-ins, you're talking about your key position guys. So. What needs to happen for that to progress? Does Matt Burton, I know he's new to the club, does he have to take some more control? How does how do you see that getting better? Oh look, I thought Matty's kicking at times was brilliant, you know, in the first half, but the the kick after half time probably summed it up, you know, and when Matty had the ball um, and played the ball and just it just put us on the back foot straight away. And across the board we need to be we just need to be better in that area, you know. So um, yeah. Yeah. Do you think about moving Josh out of car at all, Trent? Like whenever he gets the ball, he looks really dangerous in space, but that seems to not happen enough for, for for a guy of his caliber. Yeah, definitely. You know, and it's going to come with more possession you get and the better quality ball that he's getting. You know, Josh is relying on a lot of things that happen inside him. You know, and he's got a license to get around the field as well. But um, you know, there's it's hard to to put blame on your winger when you know. Not a lot going right inside him, um, you know. But getting him more ball and getting Burton more ball is, you know, we need the ball in their hands. But you got to hang on to it first to to do that. So. How's Corey? Uh, I haven't seen him yet, mate. He, he looked a bit sick, so hopefully he's okay. Thank you.